Hey everyone, so Merry Christmas, first year in the camper 2017. I just, um, I haven't done a video in a really long time, so I just wanted to take the time to update you guys. It's been a really, really busy year. Um, I've been working on the property, and also I've been taking the time to rebuild my business. Um, do you want to say hi for my YouTube video? Yeah. Say hi, Nathaniel. Hi. Hey, so this is my son, Nathaniel. He's going to be eight pretty soon. And yeah, we wanted to take the time to show you guys the inside of our camper and show them how nice we did everything, right? We're still in the middle of um, updating our camper, so there's still a lot to do, but we've done a fair amount. So here we go. Okay, so... I ended up changing out curtains and everything that I found in this camper, I've either, either have um, done some recycling, finding stuff, or going to our local thrift shop. Um, we still have to, you know, do a lot of painting here. We've got company coming, so we're displaying, you know, some of our food and then I'm going to bring out the rest whenever they come. What, babe? Oh, yeah. We hung a little Christmas decorations. We try to keep things very minimal in our camper because we like to keep things pretty much organized. So, um, I haven't replaced the couch yet, but here's a really good idea for you guys that you can do. Um, this is a queen size blanket with a duvet on it. And then I just squeezed it into the couch. It keeps it warm and also a lot more comfortable. And... Here, I'm not done painting, so I've got to paint back here, but, um, excuse you, okay, I put Molly's bed down here, but they don't use it, they all sleep in the bed, and we've added more dishes down there, and our picnic bench is set up with our little outside rug, the awning is out, it's really beautiful. Um, oh, okay. And then in the bathroom, back here, we went ahead and hung these really cool shower curtains that I found at the thrift shop for like a dollar. And rugs. Yeah, and this is where I burn incense and just let it fall into the sink. We hung, we hung like little festive, little hand towels, just trying to make it look as homey as possible. I'm absolutely loving this turquoise color that I picked out. Um, I still, like I said, I still have a lot to do. And then inside the cabinets right here and right there, I've decided I'm probably going to use... Probably going to use some like mosaic tiles and... Um, I don't know, maybe glue them in there or figure out a way to make them stay. And then the empty spots up there uh, that I took the cloth off, I'm going to do the same thing, you know, either cut glass or um, do some kind of tile or something up there for that. So, wow, what an interesting year. There's a lot of stuff that happened in the camper this year. Um, my... Let's see, God, what all happened? I had to replace the gas leak detector, um, fire alarms, the carbon monoxide. Um, I had to do a lot of resealing, and I had, oh, here's a good one for you. So I had to go underneath my sink, and they have these black traps that go into your sink, and I could not figure out where this nasty like fumey shit smell was coming from and then I figured out it was coming after going to the online Facebook forums and stuff I figured out they were coming from uh, these black traps that you can replace I mean you can get them at Lowe's or anything like that and they only cost about like four or five dollars so I ended up replacing those um, luckily it was an easy fix all you have to do is unscrew them and then put them back on but I will say this everything in a camper is really really like tight fitting and small so to like try to get in somewhere and wedge something under there it was really really hard 
Um, oh my gosh, Molly. Making noise like that. They're going to think it was me. So, oh, my insulation did really good. Um, our weather dropped to like, I think like 17 degrees was our coldest so far. And we did have snow and we did good with that. Um, that was fun having to go up on the roof and try to shovel off some of that snow. But um, I never lost water or power one time. So I was really proud of myself for doing a good job with the insulation underneath all of the crawl spaces. Um, I just used the foam boards and stuff. So that was a plus. Mm -hmm.